uh, over the years that the Plattsburgh Air Force Base was active uh, on many different occasions. Uh, Guards and security policemen that were walking the grounds late at night would report having strange uh, encounters here inside the, the grounds of the cemetery. Uh, witnessing unusual lights, apparitions, uh, uh, disembodied mists, things like that. And even on our tours, we, we have had folks who have captured uh, strange anomalies on their cameras, cell phones, all sorts of things. So clearly our, our residents are still, uh, still active. My name is Matt Boyer. I am the tour director for the Greater Adirondack Ghost and Tour Company. Uh, for the last six seasons, we've been doing lantern lit guided ghost tours right here in the Champlain Valley uh, of upstate New York. Uh, we have four different tours that we currently offer right here in the Plattsburgh area. We have Dr. Beaumont's Tour of Terror, which is our downtown tour, it covers the uh, uh, kind of heart of the city and some of the uh, historic district down there. We have the Ghosts of the Old Post, which is our tour here of the uh, grounds of the former Plattsburgh Air Force Base. Uh, we also have the Specters and Soldiers Tour, uh, which is kind of a combination uh, cemetery tour and whatnot. And then we also have the Spirits of SUNY Plattsburgh, which kind of explores the mystery of uh, the city's college and university campus. Plattsburgh is a very early community here in upstate New York. It goes back to the 1790s. So anywhere where you have that depth of history, uh, the, you know, the, the Lake Champlain was, was a highway for uh, even Native Americans traveling north and south. And then it became kind of the, the, the uh, seat of war during the Revolution, the War of 1812. So whenever you've got that history, that conflict, you always have that other that's kind of left behind. You know, the, the, those remnants of the past that are still kind of making their presence known. Our downtown tour is very popular. Uh, basically, we took the story of, of a local doctor by the name of William Beaumont and he expanded on that. Dr. Beaumont was known in medical circles as the father of modern gastric science. And he was practicing medicine here in Plattsburgh in the early 19th century. But not many people really talk about some of the uh, ways that he learned, you know, through some of his experiments that he was doing on a living human test subject. Uh, uh, back in those days, there wasn't a lot of rules between doctor-patient relationships and things. And uh, he, he, was, he was kind of a creepy character. And we follow in his footsteps, so to speak. We visit some of the exact locations where his office was, where he would have uh, um, been right at home when he was alive here in the city uh, 200 years ago. Yeah, and then we also include, you know, ghost stories, murders, hangings, sinister science experiments, all the good stuff they don't teach you in school. 